Time now for an update from Fox Carolina News and Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rates certified most accurate. Good evening, I'm Victoria Carmen with your flash briefing. I want to show you one of the top headlines trending on FoxCarolina.com tonight. And it's a surveillance photo we received today. Greenville police looking for the driver of this SUV, which is believed to be a Honda CRV. It was involved in a hit and run with a baby stroller. So this happened yesterday, Wednesday afternoon in the middle of the day. Greenville police says around 138, this white SUV that you see up here, it turned left on Gallivan Street and it hit a stroller carrying two small children as someone was pushing it down a crosswalk on North Main Street near downtown Greenville. And then that SUV continued at high speed on Main Street towards downtown. So they're looking for any information. If you know anything about this car, who was driving it, if you saw something to please contact Greenville police. Police did describe the driver as a woman um, who was a little bit older, 60 to 70 years old with short haircuts and large sunglasses. Uh, but that's really all that we know at this point. Thankfully, nobody was hurt here. Both children are OK. Let's turn to the forecast now. Chief Meteorologist Kendra Kent here as we continue to track the tropics mm -hmm. and brace for Delta. That's right. Hurricane Delta will bring us some rain over the weekend, but we will get the lighter end of this storm. That's for sure. Uh, you can see it's going to be barreling into Louisiana as a major hurricane somewhere near Cameron, either over toward uh, Lake Charles, potentially as far to the east as Baton Rouge. Uh, but essentially the, the models are in very good agreement about where it's going to make landfall. It moves inland and then pretty good agreement about it moving basically right through Tennessee, uh, bringing some heavy rain into the Tennessee Valley. We'll see some of that rain as well as it approaches our area late Saturday into Sunday um, with the heaviest of the rain expected at the end of the weekend. There's another look at those computer models and notice they're in really good agreement about this staying generally away from our area, at least the center of circulation, and that's going to minimize our severe weather risk, but we will still have a few strong storms possible on Sunday. Here's a look at your Friday forecast. Clouds move in. It's not as hot. Highs will be in the low 70s. Of course, for much more on your rain chance outlook for this weekend, be sure to tune in on on the morning news Friday morning as well as at 4, 5, 10 and 11 for the latest and download the Fox Carolina app.